Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Learn Math with Mr. Saad. Today's lesson for grade 4, chapter 4, lesson 8, multiply with regrouping. Page number is 241. Okay, multiply with regrouping. Regrouping is what, guys, see this example here, like we are multiplying 13 by 4. So what do we do? 4 times 3 is 12. We write 2 here and 1 up. When we write, we take 1 carry up, so that is known as regrouping. Now what we do, 4 times 1, 4, and then we add this one, it becomes 5, so 52. Uh, here, they are using the distributive property, break 13 into 2 parts, 10 and 3, then multiply 4 with 10 and 4 with 3. 4 times 10, 40, 4 times 3, 12, and then the answer is 52, same. So we check our answer using the distributive property. Next page, uh, this is the estimation, and this one is the actual problem. 6 times 8 is 48, we write 8 down here, and 4 up. We did the regrouping of 4 tens. Now, 6 times 3 is 18 plus 4. 22. We don't need another number. We don't have another number to regroup. So we'll write 22 down here. So the answer is 228. Okay, similarly this one. Uh, guys, This is these are the estimations. If you want, you can write, but not necessary. Okay, so this one, 4 times 3, 12, 2 here, 1 up. And then 4 times 2, 8 plus 1, 9. So 92. 6 times 2, 12, 2 here, 1 up here, here also 1 up, 6 times 4, 24, plus 1, 25, okay, next page, independent practice, and these questions also, we have estimation, these are the estimations, if you want, you can write, but not necessary, okay, so this one, 5 times 3, 15, 5 here, and 1 up. And then again, 5 times 3, 15, plus 1, 16. So guys, similarly, like this, solve all these problems, and then match your answers from this video. For these questions, you can write these problems again, like this. 29 times 4. And then you can solve it, 4 times 9, 36, 6 here, 3 up, and 4 times 2, 8, plus 3 equals 11. Yes, guys, solve all these questions. Estimations are not important, okay? And then match your answers from this video. Well, next page now. Okay. A local cave has walking tour. Adult ticket cost $18. Child tickets cost $15. And gemstone panning cost $12 per person. So, the first question. The Daisy's family has two adults. Two adults means adult ticket cost $18. So, two times 18 2 times 18 is here. Sixteen, one up, two times one, two, thirty-six. And the child ticket cost fifteen dollars. So they have three children. Fifteen times three, three times five, fifteen, five here, one up, three times one, three plus one, four. And then you will add both of them, 36 plus 45, 81. Can the Daisy Diaz family plan for gemstones for $75? So gemstone, they have how many persons? 2 and 3, 5. And gemstone panning is 12. So 5 times 12 is 60. So yes, they can do it in $75. They have enough money. Okay. Find the total cost of Dia's family to take the walking tour and pan for gemstone 
uh, you have to add this 60 and 81 so total is 141 write two multiplication problems that when the products are added together have a sum of 240 so these are there are more tell me more in uh, the comment box like 3 times 40 is 120 and 6 times 20 120 so when you add 120 plus 120 240 give me another example for this question in the comment box guys okay circle the multiplication problem that does not belong with other three so in these three we don't need regrouping but in this one we need regrouping like to take carry 8 times 2 is 16 6 here and 1 up in this one we don't need to write any number up what steps can I use to multiply by a two digit number with regrouping? Multiply the ones, regroup, multiply the tens, add the regroup to tens. That's it. So thank you so much guys. I hope you understand the lesson. If you really understand, don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel. Learn math with Mr. Saab. Thank you so much. Have a nice day.